Sunday or whenever you're getting to watch this if you watch it later. So it is Thanksgiving week in the United States. So I know a lot of you watch from other places and welcome and I'm so glad that you join us each week and do that. That is so special to me. But I'm going to play a lot of Thanksgiving hymns. So whether or not you're celebrating it in your country like we are in the States, it's never a bad time to give lots of praise to the Lord. So I want it to be a year-round attitude of my heart, and I try for that. But tonight we are going to focus very specifically on songs that talk about praise to God, blessings that He's given us, um, just having a thankful heart. So a lot of you wrote down comments when I posted that we were going live. So I've got a list of some of those, and we'll play through those throughout the evening. But please feel free to put your requests in for songs that talk about God's goodness to us and blessings. And also, I want you to fill the comments with, I sound like Emily right now, if you guys to comment, but I want you to fill the comments with things that you're thankful for. And let's just really focus on having an attitude of gratefulness to God throughout this entire session. So, I'm going to go now to Showers of Blessings. So, that's a song about blessings. And put your request in while I'm doing that. So. So let's see, that was Showers of Blessings and then You Are My All in All. And that was from the afternoon request. And I forgot to tell you what I started with. So I started with um, Thankful, a song that I think it's on Polar Express too, but Josh Groban recorded that years ago on his Christmas album. So that was like a secular song about thankfulness and just how much we do have. So 
Very, very true. And then I went into, thank you, Lord, for your blessings on me. Just a good old Southern gospel song. And then, let's see. I did another one in the middle there, but I can't think of what it was. So, and then that was showers of blessings and you were my all in all. So, I want to hear from you guys what you're requesting and you want to hear. And I've seen Count Your Blessings pop up quite a few times on the comments. So, I'm going to play that one next too. But, is there another one I should do first? Okay, so we'll do Count Your Blessings. And my husband Josh sits behind the camera. So, if you're just joining us for the first time, I'm Natalie. Clearly, I'm at the piano. And then Josh sits behind the camera and tells me the requests as they come in from you guys. So it's a definitely a team effort. And I'm very, I'm thankful for him. So.
blessings into leaning on the everlasting arms and then thank you Lord for saving my soul, a good chorus, and then God is so good. That one just popped in my head. I don't know that anybody had requested it, but I think I just heard it in my head right after thank you Lord for saving my soul. God is so good. I know there's a hundred verses you could put with that that fit that melody, but that's a good one. Okay, let's see. I'm going to hit a couple more of these. We gather together and come, you thankful people, come are like the two Thanksgiving hymns. I don't know that there's a lot of Thanksgiving hymns. Also, now thank we all our God. So I'm going to do those. Now thank we all our God. I'll do first. So let's see. seeing all of you guys comments about things that you're thankful for thank you so much for putting those in there okay this is we gather together This is Come Ye Thankful People Come. Okay, well, I have been fiddling with everything for, well, the whole time. And I have <laughs> determined, I'm not sure, well, I have determined that everything is right on my end and it's getting to the feed, but it does 
there were I don't know if it was Facebook putting an unusual amount of compression on the audio or what. Who but knows? Anyway, hopefully it's better now. If not, oh well, we're doing the best we can. <laughs> and I see people commenting that they can hear me, and that's good. This is good. That, that's progress. This is good. Okay. All right. I don't know. I missed a lot of requests, but mm, I've gone okay. back and, and grabbed a few. Have you done um, Thank God I Am Free? No. That's a great one. I hadn't thought about that one as a thank you song. Okay. <laughs> Have you done Make Me a Blessing? No, that's a great one. Okay. I hope it's in here, though. That's not it's one I like. It's in Soul liked. Stirring. It's in Soul Stirring? Okay. Yes. Thank you. So we're not actually featuring a hymnal tonight. I'm just playing lots of songs that talk about blessings. So 334. I like this one a lot. And for anyone in the Charlotte area, we will be um, at Shining mm -hmm. Light Baptist yep. in Monroe. Tomorrow night singing. I think it's mm -hmm. a 7 o'clock service. Yep. Is that right? Thanksgiving yeah. revival. So that's their Thanksgiving revival. Someone commented that Brother Byron Fox is preaching a revival at their church. Oh, yeah. He this produced week. our album, We Need the Church, our family's vocal album that's available on my website. Okay. What are we playing? We need, uh, no. <laughs> Make me a blessing. <laughs> Make me a blessing. I forgot what I was playing. Okay, let's see.
And I was struck, I posted a couple, I don't know, a week or so ago, something, I don't remember. But I do remember that several of the comments had people saying that they were going to be spending the holiday, whether it was Thanksgiving or Christmas or something around this time of year, alone. And when I was just now playing Make Me a Blessing, I was thinking that really should be all of our prayer. And I would encourage you, like, reach out to somebody who you know might be alone or might be, this might be a tough time of year, whether that be because of loneliness or a recent loss, and check on those people. This has been a tough year on a lot of people emotionally, not just financially or physically because of sickness. It's just been a tough year. Lots of quarantining, being away from people that you love, not being able to have that connection and talking. So reach out to them during this holiday season. It's so easy to get caught up in the everything I have to get done that I don't always notice the needs of those around me. But I think this year more than ever, we need to be more attentive to the needs of others. And may that be all of our prayer that the Lord would make us a blessing to the people in our lives, those that we see every day and those that we might not see every day, but we know have a hurting heart during this time of year. So. Um, there were some questions that I'm going to respond okay. to, and that Absolutely. is Shining Light Baptist Church in Monroe. Mm -hmm. Um. Tomorrow. Someone said they wished we would come to Asheville, and we were actually supposed to be there Tuesday night, but they just canceled mm -hmm. the service. So maybe sometime soon. We do yeah. have some other dates actually scheduled in Asheville. I don't know exactly when they are. I think they're next year sometime. Um, let's see. I have a few that I wrote down that Kay. I don't know. We'll see if you know. Who or knows? maybe they're in one of the books. Okay. <laughs> The first one is give thanks with a grateful heart. Yes, I, I I, can't remember if I played that. I think I played that at the beginning. I'll do it one more time just in case. Do you play the Hallelujah Chorus? No. I need to learn the Hallelujah Chorus. I Sorry, know, but not, not folks, a piano version. I knew that. That's why I haven't mentioned it. But there have been <laughs> many requests for it tonight. And oh, so maybe that'll be my I goal to learn it. Inspired to respond. All right. The next one I wrote down, and what I wrote doesn't make sense. So. Oh, dear. I hope. I, I'm guessing I, I made a mistake here, but it <laughs> says, let. Everything now living, or let, all things. Uh, let all I don't things know. now living. I think that's actually a hymn, but I don't know it. I've just seen it in a hymnal at some point in time, but I don't know which one. All right. How about let's just praise the Lord? Oh, yeah. Man, that's a great one. I did that for <laughs> Prelude.
like that song. Okay. How about the doxology? Praise God from whom all blessings flow. Yeah. Mm. tribute. I'll do the chorus. That was a very poor version of my tribute. I'll practice that one. That one threw me off guard. And I haven't practiced it in a while, so I should. So. Yeah, I'm sure it's in it Songs is. from the Heart. I think it actually um, is. Oh, I, I could have done a much better rendition if I had just taken a second and looked it up in the hymnal. We have come into this house. Uh, I don't know that one well. I know it a little bit. Actually, you know what? I think I played it last week. It's in the Rejoice hymnal. But I don't know that I have it memorized. Okay. Well, if you played it last week... Yeah, That's I did play it last week. I think it was one of the first couple I played last week. All right. Um, I'm going to play um, the one I did. What did we sing tonight? And I've got so I much to thank him, him for. I will praise him, and I've got so much to thank him for. So I'll Have do you those done back praise back. him, praise him? No. Well, there's I'll do three. all three of those. There you go. Let me see if I can remember that. Praise him, praise him. I will praise him, and I've got so much to thank him for. Okay, we can do this. <laughs> Thank you. 
So I did those three. What was it? Praise Him, praise Him. I will praise Him. I've got so much to thank Him for. And then I went into I am blessed, or some people sing it in the plural, we are blessed. But that's a great Thanksgiving song. Man, you guys are coming up with some wonderful Thanksgiving or just songs about God's blessing, so I'm enjoying it. Have you done the one, uh, I think it's So Blessed? Um, I know it. Oh, oh, the Harvest uh-huh. Time one. Oh, Primitive Quartet songs. No, I have not. Our family has sung that for years. That's actually the first song I played on the piano as a special in church, like for people to sing, for our family to sing. And I was wh- so nervous. What's it? We it's are so blessed. That's the net Harvest title. Time is what it's sometimes called. Okay. But yeah. <laughs> Just a couple left. Okay. Um, I don't know that they're necessarily Thanksgiving, but they're good songs anyway. The okay. first one is He Touched Me. Oh, yeah. It's just like his great love. It's just like uh, a friend I have in Jesus, right? Is that the beginning?
had to play through it twice because the first time I was just trying to remember each phrase as I finished the previous one. So the second time I enjoyed it more because then it, it came back to me. So I have only known that one a little while. I think we sing out of the soul stirring songs and hymns at Josh's church where when I married him, I went there. So um, that was a new one for me to learn. I had never, I think I'd heard maybe part of the chorus, but I've enjoyed that song. All right. Do you know Hallelujah, Hallelujah? I do. Like the children's praise chorus, the Praise Ye the Lord. Yes, of course. <laughs> make you stand up when it's your part whether you're the hallelujahs or the praise ye the lord so i didn't feel like adding that into that song but yeah it needed that oh well <laughs> i'm gonna play um the song um thank you lord for making the sun to shine putting the stars in the sky that one so it was requested in the afternoon so i wrote it down That was praise to the Lord, the Almighty. So I saw it on my list that I had made a note to remind myself to play it. I like that song. And it's about praise, and somebody requested it. All right. Well, <sighs> okay, let's see. I'll let you wrap it up. If there are any other Thanksgiving songs that I haven't gotten, let's see. I'm going to end with Blessed Be the Tie That Binds. Let's see. Come Thou Fount. So yeah, I think that's the only two out of the Thanksgiving songs that I 
thought of or that were requested. I guess all those were requested pretty much. Yeah. So I'll do blessed be the tie that binds and come thou fount. So man, thank you guys so much for joining us this evening. This has been so fun. I loved getting to focus on an attitude of gratitude that I hope will just continue all year long, not just this week, but as we do take a little extra time to focus on those blessings, offer those prayers right to the Lord. Like just spend some extra time thanking him this week for um, the good things. I heard a message this past week and the speaker said, it says in everything give thanks, not for everything give thanks. And you might be in a situation that you're really not thankful for, but ask the Lord to show you something you can be thankful about in spite of that. And really for a believer, no matter what you face here on earth, this is as bad as it could ever possibly get because you have heaven waiting on you on the other side. And for the believer, death is a doorway. And we are going to meet Jesus, and that is a fact. You can rest your soul upon the words in his Bible because he is true. The Bible says God cannot lie. So just know that whatever you're going through, you have the promise of heaven, the promise of eternal life, and the promise that Jesus said, I will never leave thee nor forsake thee. So. Thank you for joining us this evening. I hope you all have a wonderful Thanksgiving week or if you're in another country that you still have a wonderful week. We're just going to be focusing on our blessings here.